Cosby Psychos from Melbourne, Australia. Here's three ugly looking blokes, you know, touring the world, playing in all these wonderful cities, dying at all these wonderful restaurants, See meeting all these around. famous people. In the back of your head, you're going, I'm thinking to myself, I'm going, well, I'm a fucking farmer. Once I found the Cosmic Psychos, it was kind of like, yeah, these guys are what I've been, what I've been looking for for a while. Live was always so huge and powerful. I guess it would remind me more of like late 70s punk rock. You know, played through a stereo inside of a muffler of a car dragging down the freeway. That's what they sound like. <laughs> I think the Cosmic Psychos were a band that was highly influential on the Seattle so-called grunge scene. They're pretty freaking exotic to, to me, you know, like they're, you know, from a completely different life, different world, and uh, they didn't try to be anything than the, other than the, what they were, you know. Their songs about driving a bulldozer. For me, that was like, wow, okay, Aussie punk rock. You know, that, that's, that's punk rock to me. This is a great band that you could pull from Australian you know, They're our ambassadors. Have a listen to their lyrics. They sing about dead kangaroos. We were fucking ugly. I and mean, there's no way, I mean, Robbie looked like one of the bloody Marx brothers. Bill was just a bald fucking midget. And I was just, this, I was running around with a mullet. Yeah, you know, with a head like a fucking robber's dog. She's a mother's girl. 